I'm gonna use my last <laughs> spell slot to heal uh, Rhiannon. Yeah. So. Hold up a chicken. Behold a man. Here's my very last one. I mean, behold the been. being that behold. dies. Wasn't repeatedly. that? What was their definition of human when he did that? It was they were bi they were bi featherless pedal. biped, right? Yeah, featherless biped. So he plucked a chicken of all its feathers, held it up, also, and said, "Behold, also, a man." Real quick, because I was using it as a level two spell, because that was right. my only slot, so, you get this additional D eight, I believe. Yeah. So I'm just gonna let you guys know I only have at most two and a half to three hours. All right. All right. You get seventeen right. health points. You're now up. Uh, actually, they're called hit points. Uh, right, I'm gonna walk over. I walk over down the hall, and I see. First thing I see is Trisferian with uh, the captain. Guy. Actually, you see George's character. I kind of. I Come lightly on. jog in. Yeah, my character was the first one here. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I, I lightly jog in, and I say, uh, I, say uh, I say, very good. Now, what do we have here? For some reason, when I try to put myself behind George, it keeps putting me inside the wall. Yeah, I see that. I walk forward. Bethesda! So... No, there is just another brick in the wall. I, I, I walk towards... <laughs> oh my I walk God. towards the man, and then I look at Trisferian and I say, You figure we should take him anywhere else, or is he just fine? Nah, I was, uh, thinking a nice candlelit diner on, uh, the other side of town. Here's it's a funny. good place. Plenty of positive reviews, honestly. And a couple of good reviews on Yelp. I was gonna make that joke, but we don't have fantasy Yelp. No. We can. So, jokes aside. First of all, who are you? What is your name? I am Dick Fury. There are some who call me Tim. Mutiny, all fuckers. <laughs> I mean, George. I'm still waiting on a. Uh, uh, George. For all you know, he could be an enchanter, so. Damn true. Bail! I am filled with ungodly okay, amounts that's of rage, rage but no energy there. is actually exerted. Alright, I've unmuted yeah. you too. Must make more jokes then. Still waiting for that response from John. Did not I did say it's jam true. Can Jam's can you repeat that again? Jam true. Jam yeah, true. Jam. Where's the jelly false you have in here? Where's jelly false at? Well, uh, and whom do you serve, Mister True? Did you just try to assume his gender? <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> now I know it's gonna turn out. Hey, well, I'm male. gonna leave after that. <laughs> Life is no longer worth living. I, no, I it, understand. It was to begin with. No life is worth Whom do you serve? Saruman. Saruman. What are those latest scenes with gems? Is his answer Saruman? No. <laughs> no. That would just be. Yeah, I asked hey, him what his. Who if he we have to bring back Chris Lee in this. We're... If you have to bring back Christopher Lee this way, this is what we have to do. We just, yeah, no, the villain is we just have Christopher Lee. Hey, you can't say he does a bad job. Nope. <laughs> he was usually the best kind of villain. You're like, hey. We finally, we finally get up there and he says, 
So you have chosen death. What we need to do is make sure that the enemy is Christopher Lee, but he has a golden crossbow. A golden hand crossbow. Made out of pure be, gold. He needs to be dressed yep. like the Holy Roman Emperor Charlemagne. He needs to have a third nipple. That, uh... He must be waving around this thing of French to, bread. Are you trying to come up with a cult name? Right now? <laughs> Because I asked him, whom do you serve about three minutes ago? Like, do you actually know the name? Yeah, 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 obviously. There's just some lag input with my microphone. Meanwhile, shuffle around papers like, oh, just take this. <laughs> He's looking for, like, his membership ID. Fuck, what's it called? We are called the, the Mormons. We are called the Knights of Me. <laughs> The knights who say the N word. My God. All right, I'm sorry, I was back. I had to go fix my daughter. Ah. Oh, all right. See, he had, a good, he had a good excuse. Yeah, we were for all... just going away from the microphone for a minute. Like, what the fucking name? What is it called? What the, we the were cult all, of, we were uh... wondering where you were. Uh... Also, uh, Bass asks, "Who do who I serve?" Is? Lar Roach. The Sorcerer King. The Sorcerer King. La Roche. La Roche. Linden La Roche. Isn't that the name of a horse? No, no Linden Roche is, Linden Roche Roche is, is the name of the horse. No, isn't Roach the name of a... Witcher's horse, yes. Geralt's horse, yeah. Well, I, yeah. I mean, is this a... somebody... It's a question. It's, is this somebody that we would have heard of? No. You want to do a history check? No. Um, yeah, sure, roll it. I suck. No. <laughs> no, I got it. One second. One second. Yep. History check. Go. You, you want a you history check? Let me get my character sheet. Let me switch my as to myself. <laughs> oh, yeah. Can uh, I re-roll mine? Since... <laughs> uh, history check. Wait a second. This yeah. is Ooh. this is the guy. Fuck, I'm not actually proficient in that. Thank you. What? That's even worse. I rolled a uh, two. I know. Yeah. Can I, like, retroactively yeah, even use my help action? Your book, man. <laughs> no. Alright, so, alright, I'm gonna also yeah. roll to see if I'm, 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 Okay, I'm gonna roll! Wait, why am I proficient in survival? Alright. What? Uh, why <laughs> not? I didn't ask pick yourself. a survival proficiency. I got 16. Hey, Does what do you know? You Reading that? all those books, did, oh. did you? Did I, do I recognize the name of LaRouche? That's... Um, you recognize Ledlu. You recognize the name, and you recognize that it, this is um, some like three hundred plus years in the past. The red. So your group, your followers of the Sorcerer King, all of you. Yes. And you are responsible for what has happened to this place? Yeah. If that's right, DM. <laughs> mm. Wait, you say... What was the name again? La Roche. La Roche. La Roche. Is there La Roche. a second L? No, there's just one L. Well, there's two L's, technically. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Oh, you went this way. Oh. I'm convinced that it's just La, oh. La Roche. That better not be Lelouch. We're gonna have fun, <laughs> folks. De, 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 I know where he's yeah. going with this. I'm not gonna be happy. <laughs> Here. <laughs> and you're responsible ah. for what has happened to this town? What is going on in the town? We don't leave this crypt. The sun has not moved in the sky for two days. I have trouble believing you know nothing about that. He straight up looks puzzled. He has no clue what you're talking about. I roll insight. I don't buy it. This is bullshit. Are you sure you're speaking in a language he can understand? He could have been inside this damn 20. thing. Ever He's been in here for... Okay, 
I can't tell you how long I've been in here, but I can tell you that it's been far too long. I don't even know what year or what month it is. In this cult hmm. of the Sorcerer King, who are you? Wait, so he, he said that? Yes. He has no idea what year, what day, what month, what anything. No. It's been a goddamn mole in that hole. What do you think? Did you overhear anyone talk about anything going on outside this crypt? We're on strict orders to not go anywhere near the outside. Strict orders from whom? Tell me. The person me. we follow. Hmm? The person we follow. The Sorcerer King? Yes. Some... You're telling me you received direct orders from a being who has been dead for centuries to stay here. And you have nothing to do with the corruption of the temple on the surface and with the sun not moving. I find that hard to believe, to be honest. But you, I think you're honest in that you know nothing about it. So, Carrie asked something. Oh yeah, Carrie asked something. Yeah, I just... It didn't matter when I asked, to be honest, so that's why I just left it alone. She, she um, did write, uh, what was the last year you remember? You well, that's going to be a slight issue because we never actually set a year for this. So. Well, I mean, but I would imagine you could, um, like, you have a year in your head. And, I mean, what, I, what I mean is, like, date, baby. Obviously, it doesn't matter what year you pick it is currently. It just matters what the year is that he believes is from. You know what I mean? Okay, okay, I got you. Um, but yeah, just to put a... Like, uh, we can sit there and say it's fucking 2,533 AD. Just, I don't give a fuck. Just to put, a, just to put a, a year on it for shits and giggles, let's say 1444 is now. It's the EU4 start date. Fuck it. Last time I remember, it was... I'll say 1435. So nine, nine years? years ago. Yeah, has it been that long? It's fourteen forty-four. How old? Okay, here's a question. How old does the guy look like? Yeah, how old is this guy? Um, about mid-age. Middle age. High mid-age. High middle age. Okay. How old were you when you came in here? All right. That's not really good. He to... literally looks at himself and goes about this. What? Ah, uh, hold on. I gotta message you, John, because now I'm, I'm 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 now curious about something. Well, you can't. Hey, that's out of character. No, 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 no. I, he, John knows exactly what the hell I'm talking about here. He 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 goaded me a, a several I've several all weeks before. You were saying no. you were about this age, nine uh, years ago. Yes. In a town where the sun has not moved since I stepped inside. Do you not grasp this, the severity of this? The sun not moving? I have no idea what that's about. You have an idea. You haven't. If what you're saying is true, you haven't aged. Or do I not? Or do I misunderstand you? No, you completely understand that. And what is your explanation for not aging? What? What happens here? What was the with the corpse room? With that pentagram? That is so we can keep. The orbs that are over there protected. The orbs. Yes. And did you lose one recently? That's my question. No. Okay. I'll move them to the top layer. Ah. And these orbs—they are here. Yes. And you and you people guard them. 
yes. Well, then I'd wager all of your other fellow guardians are dead. I want you to take me to these orbs. Now. I'm just gonna shut my fucking mouth while I watch this. <laughs> I follow behind I him. Something. I look back and I say, come on. Before we go any further, one more question. Okay. Have you ever heard of a man, just by chance, named Luigi Cadorna? I was about to come in and say play. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Or play He's a very devoted follower. What? Does it mean you guys inadvertently I... cut him down? Wit. No, no, I th I don't think it'd be that. I don't. Think... I cur I I sort of curse to myself. Can you say that one more time, please? He is a grand dragon. What do you mean he's he... a very devoted oh. follower? I don't know how to be any more specific than that. He very devoted to our calls. Is he? Where is he? He is... He is with the king. Okay. I'm away from my computer, so I'm going to ask this in character, but out of character. I'm not actually dialoguing this bit, but... um, Willingly? Yes, willingly. not charm, not charms, not anything like that. It's just no. He's willing. He came willingly, and he's not half mad. You know. When no? and okay. when? When did you meet Luigi Cadorna? Mm. You're gonna ask the man. He has no idea of time <laughs> right now. <laughs> when did you meet him? Uh, he, he sometime in my past like yesterday, but. I don't know time, so maybe I should have rephrased that. <laughs> There's no other way maybe. to rephrase it, buddy. <laughs> Recently, I'm trying. Maybe, probably... That wouldn't have been quite helpful here either. <laughs> He's been gone for a year, and to them, it's been nine years. Well, just because he's been gone. You see, I was under the impression you're still in the wall that. <clears throat> <laughs> Cadorna was trying to retrieve one of these orbs. At least he was. It, out of character, Jeff, I, I'm pretty sure your character could probably piece this bit together. I mean, they're trying to get a bunch of, they have a bunch of orbs. He managed to stick, take an orb that actually fits in with everything here. Yeah. I mean, I'm just trying to figure out, like, if. Well, George, his character might be able to figure out, but he might not be able to. No, 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 no. I have more faith in his, uh... I have more faith in what little mind he has left from weed. Um... <laughs> so they said that the... Okay, just to clarify, they said they were trying to gather orbs of some kind? Yes. So far, he has stopped okay. time in the entire city? Well, they claim to if they're gathering about... orbs together, it stands to reason that this is not the desired effect, per se. It could be no. a combination effect of what they currently have in combination. But if another orb or two is brought, like the one that's missing, it could bring about the desired effect, which is All pretty right. much what I'm guessing. Maybe a reason. I have no fucking clue, and I'm a veteran D&D &D player. I'm trying to piece this together, because he says, you should know what this is. Eh. No, no, honestly, you not knowing what this is is very likely because this is. I'm pulling this is from second edition. Oh, okay. Which is probably yeah, before right. most of you were born. Dude, that's before you were born, I think. <laughs> no, it is. I'm pretty sure I was in. Can I, I sure okay. second edition might was I the ask 80s. another question of the man? I was born in the 80s, Yo. thank you. You were born in like 88, 89. No, I was born in 82. Anyway. Out of game. Another, I'm gonna ask another question <clears throat> of, of the man. Yes, you can ask a question. 
All right. Um, <clears throat> and where you say he is with the Sorcerer King? Yes. And where is the Sorcerer King? I currently do not know that answer. A shame. And these up ahead, I take it, are your orbs? Yes. There are only two of them. That is correct. One of them did Cardona take. If how Cardona... many, if I might know, is two the correct Mav. number, or how many are there? Yeah. Do you have identify? What? Do you have identify? Unfortunately. Okay, out of game, I'd like the to guess that cast those bitch. orbs are at least attempted to be used to resurrect the Sorcerer King. Watch are these, yeah, what are so, these orbs? So do you guys want He's alive, to guys. Identify? I mean, you can just ritual cast a damn thing and not waste a slot. Well, I don't have it prepared, so I can only ritual cast it. I would do it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's gotta give me... An hour? Eleven minutes. Oh, that's an hour. All right. It's that's ten minutes. It's ten minutes to ritual cast. Really? Mm -hmm. That was an hour. It's ten minutes I plus can... cast time. Mm. Well, I'm my... going to be shaking maracas, staring at a pearl for ten minutes. <laughs> well, my friend uh, shakes his maracas. That, that I mean, that was a joke. Like, I, I want to point out, you can no, sprint, no, 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 it's no. now canon. You can sprint like a fifteen k marathon while ritual casting. Yeah, I can but move around can... and do backflips. While he, while my friend is uh, casting his spell, <laughs> tell me, what are these orbs for? What is their purpose? Are they simply religious artifacts or something more? Something desperately more. They're disco balls. What are they? <laughs> yeah. So let me know when uh, a lot of the minutes have passed. Well, I make sure uh, that is the length of time. I swear to God, if one of them mentions a the question, emerald, <clears throat> what uh, are they? The pentagram thing that's being used up here—that's an actual pentagram, not just like a placeholder piece, right? No, that is actually on the ground. Yeah. Okay, I just want to make sure that wasn't some. Uh, so here's a question: mm -hmm. That is probably is that? Can I roll religion to see if I can think of see? Remember any cults that might actually line in with that shit, or is that too broad? We already know what the cult is for. They're the cult of the Sorcerer King. Yeah. John? <laughs> more specifics, maybe? Yeah, or... yeah, I know. It's just like, yeah, cult, but cults usually have a purpose of some kind, in this case. especially. Exactly! I asked what the, the orbs problem is, for. I know about this guy and, he's using. I'm just that... trying to... And that the pentagram on the ground is to keep the orbs in there in check. I had asked what <clears> the orbs <throat> do. But what, to prevent them just, from destroying each other? Just confirming. Or... Just confirming. It does take 10 minutes. Okay. Uh, plus the one minute normal cast time. Okay. And it doesn't expend a spell slot, and it says I must have the spell prepared or on my list of spells unless you're a wizard, then you don't. Thank you, uh, lawyer. But, um, <laughs> okay. No, um, be a lawyer, I'll keeping the orbs in check, are we talking about, again. like, just, um, are we talking from destroying each other or from their power being exerted on others? From their power being exerted on the, onto the actual plane. So these orbs are not from our plane of existence. This isn't from the material plane. Oh, no, 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 no. From having their power unscalingly disrupt the entire plane. What do they do? What are they so... for? Answer me. I'm working on it. Give oh. me a second. Oh, I had it I was... up and then I lost it. I was yelling at the guy. Oh, wait a minute. That's not the whole thing. <laughs> I need that one. There we go. To make people French. <laughs> You suddenly have an urge to surrender and drink wine and cheese, which I'm not against. 
I love X-Nails. wine. I love cheese. <laughs> you, are, you are compelled to sing La Marseillaise. Okay. Hey, to be fair, <laughs> Carrie is French. <laughs> Oh, by the way, guys, uh, Trisparian will be charging financial uh, compensation <laughs> for this. Spell casting ain't cheap, and it ain't free. It's costing you almost nothing. I don't. I don't no, it, it cost me the spell components. It's costing him spell components. <laughs> when, when you and play, time. oh no no, when you play it, it, D and when you play D and D with Americans, no no. That's, that's, <laughs> See, in order to have the privilege of casting identify, I have to have on my person a hundred gold worth of pearl. Yep. Which I had to pay for. And if you want me to use the spell... But I don't think it's consumed, is it? It's not. I held to buy it. That came out of my budget. But did you already buy it? Uh-huh. I don't see the problem, then. Uh, the I can understand if you is... didn't already have it on your person and it Don't worry. Uh, no, no, no. John, what he's basically saying is, is he wants John, the reimbursement cost for the uh, yeah. See, George, 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 for George the... have you have you ever have you ever like bought a piece of uh, how do I should I say it? Have you ever got a piece of art or something? Sure, the art took them 15 minutes to make. It only took them five years to learn how to make it in 15 minutes. Yes. What so, I'm saying is, North if you American want anyone DNA. aside from myself to know... Yeah, I'm kind of with Jeff on this one. <laughs> yeah, John, yeah it doesn't John, work. Just, uh, just, I, just DM me when the spell's done. I'm, I'm yeah. not publicly saying all the information I learned until a later date. You're going like, hey, I'm gonna need... Yo, what's your what, what's your copay on this insight cast? <laughs> well, no, Baz, Baz. Uh, think of it this way. Uh, your, your car needs oh. an oil change. You're supplying the oil. You take it to the shop. The shop still charges you. Because they had to change the oil. You didn't. Yeah, but you're a party member, not a merchant. Yeah, it costs me money to do this, though. Technically, no. It costs uh, me Technically, money. it costs me 100 gold, or I just won't identify. And then, yes, it won't cost me. You anything. already had it on your person. I had to buy it. You bought it for not not for this, but for general use. You're, okay. You're, you're... Same. My my point stands. No, not really. But okay. Okay. Uh, anyway. You needed. So we're down a person. I mean, I get why he did. Some of these conversations are really fucking obnoxious. Yeah, I mean, I didn't watch a 10 minute video. And then came back to need to uh, justify why I'm charging for identifying something. I want to, I'll identify and use the info myself. Like, it's just if you want to know. Yeah, he's charging really for the anymore. knowledge. God damn it. Uh, he's charging for the knowledge. Yeah. Which You're is like, yeah, normal. I used identify on this, which actually makes the information my intellectual property, which you need to oh, no, pay Baz. license. Baz. Ready? If you want to take it to a different wizard to cast identify on, I have to... perfectly welcome. It's a free market. Mm-hmm. Ah! I'll, I'll be right back. <laughs> One minute. I had a knock. I heard one. that. Oh, yeah. I don't know how the hell I heard that in the background. I thought it was my <clears throat> John, I swear to God, if you reference a goddamn flawless emerald, I'm gonna lose my shit. Oh no, it's not an emerald. It's definitely an you artifact. Have to gather the I'm chaos back. emeralds. <laughs> yeah, but Baz, Baz, this is Baz. Secret Sonic emerald. Adventure Two now. Baz, it, it is a free market. You know, after I'm done identifying it, if you don't want to pay the uh the, the knowledge fee, after you can all, we take it have, to a commercial wizard. We have an we have rate. no social bonds. There is only contracts between men <laughs> to mediate their differences. You can go to HR and talk out your differences to both you know. of you. <sighs> the only liberty is liberty of contract. Fuck you. 
You said you said the pentagram keeps the orbs in check. Yes. What do they do? What are they for? They're there to to try to contain the power of the orbs themselves. No, no, the orbs. What do they do? One is one controls time, and the other one is um controls time. Yes. Let him say the other one, buddy. Hey. And the other one <laughs> is for teleportation. Time and the yep. ability to travel through space. Time. Are there any more orbs like this? There's four more, I guarantee it. You have to gather all the Dragon Balls. They are dragon balls. They're mm -hmm. infinity stones, you dense motherfucker. <laughs> These are the only two that I'm aware of. There's three more, actually, Michael. Because I've been filling the blanks in between the... Filling the blanks in the pentagram. <clears throat> yeah, like one, two, well, three, that, four, Well, that five. narrows it down. Yeah, there's three more, probably. No, 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 no. We have to agree that the Shadow King is played by a very specific individual. Who is the Shadow King? The Shadow King absolutely has to be. <laughs> it has to be Josh Brolin. <laughs> the Shadow King is Josh Brolin? If y'all are wondering... <laughs> I Come on, you're trying to gather out. five powerful stones for a general pack of George, George, why are you spoiling things? Come on. <laughs> also, uh, my, my guess for what I thought it was was, uh, was great. No. I made my opinion uh, open in Dungeons & Dragons uh, tab of the I'm Discord. I'm just going to have a fun time. One second. John? Hmm. Why does like Forgotten Realms and like Greyhawk and all that just have like have the same type of antagonist for like half their villains? Um, they no, no, <laughs> you don't need to say what it is. They just all have the same. No, no, no. It's, I can, like I gave you an answer. This was early nineties. I mean, fair. <laughs> I'm, I'm. I wait, wait. I'm glad during the height of the satanic panic. <laughs> the indie chose that to be their villain constantly. Yeah. <laughs> Props to them. <laughs> Because uh, second edition actually came out in 1989, and so early 90s. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. But he is actually in third. Oh no, there's rules for him in third edition. There's rules for everyone in third edition. Yeah, but he's actually in uh, second yeah. edition as was released. No, I was thinking of uh, the next. No. <laughs> <laughs> Which which would have been way worse, to be honest, but... More fun. <clears throat> Alright, I have another question. If any man, uh, for whatever reason, disrupted this circle, what would happen? No clue. I imagine man. something horrible, yes? Uh, probably. If we ever get to a high level, Carrie's gonna hate my character. Mm-hmm. I walk. Time, Virgil kind of. Virgil looks at the, kind of, looks back to the man and just says, "Stay there," and then walks back, uh, towards like Carrie and Rhiannon and, and Darun. And he kind of whis He starts to whisper. What the fuck do we do? Luigi's in the fucking cult. He actually went and did it. He joined the... Fuck, fuck, fuck. Yeah, Darun is as useful as always. <laughs> yeah. Darun is Lydia. I am sworn <laughs> to carry your burdens. <laughs> no, he was sworn not to carry your burdens. He's just there. <laughs> He's a non-combat NPC. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Jeff, do you have any spells? There's that a cause rock knockback? that controls time, and you're like, bro, why am I here dealing with this <laughs> bullshit? 
I should be. Wait, I should okay. be back home, Jeff. Just chilling. Jeff, as a question, do you have any spells that can like throw a character back several feet? Uh, I have thunderclap. That's five feet. And, all but right. As loud as all now, hell. No, now we just need to lure Darun to a uh, cliffside, and you'll just boost Rodan with Thunderclap. <laughs> so put it. Throw him you from the Tarpian Rock. Hey, hey wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Duke? Mm hmm. I have Fog Cloud and Thunderclap, so we can make him <gasps> blind and then do it. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> And I can become invisible, so he doesn't know where it's coming from. That's, That's how we can do it. Well, he got... Cool, man. Wait, who was gang How do I not know any of these words? Who... What... Max, what... Who? You and Michael? I'm gonna say... I think he's being honest for the You're moment. just making yourself more easy to stab by the second Max. I do think I do think he is being honest for the most part. For when I asked him if he knew anything about the time distortions, he genuinely didn't know anything. I looked into his eyes and he knew nothing. Just empty well, in there. Yeah, he's a low level grunt. We should have let the leaders live. They were too dangerous if to they be kept weren't alive. dangerous magicians. You he's too dangerous to be kept alive. <laughs> I mean yeah, dude took it could like deal sixty maximum damage. Yeah, knock no, me fuck down that. below zero HP in one attack. Like, mm. y'all laugh at me getting knocked down, but if anyone else had been hit with that, y'all would have just straight up fucking died. <sighs> I know. But what do we do about these orbs? <sighs> no, you're too far away to doing anything about them right now. <clears throat> I, I know. Wait, what the? He, uh, he's asking Caroline. I'm just scared about the end of this. And if we, John, you're, if... you're evil, and I love it. <laughs> <laughs> you're very welcome. <laughs> and as far as I, and as far as I know, we can't disturb that circle, or something terrible just... will happen. Or at least this that's what they call. That's adventure. what they call this. Seem to believe. This danger could destroy virtue and his morality. Well, we can't just we cannot destroy them. It might be a bad idea to touch them, but to simply leave them here? That won't do either. Well, he said one of those controls time, right? That has one to do control... what's causing the sun bullshit. That's what I was thinking. In... Yeah, it's probably a bad idea to touch them, but we definitely can't like, As for... leave them unattended. As, if, exactly. As for the I As say for the we one. draw straws for who touches <laughs> these. The second one controls teleportation. Maybe it... This is a bit of a wild thought. Perhaps it might lead us to the Sorcerer King and to Kadorna. I... I don't know how this could have happened. Why he would have done this? To join this cult? People join cults for a lot of reasons. Healthcare, sense of community. 
dental sense of worth yeah but to join <laughs> but to join it but to join a people a group of people who participate in human sacrifice to willingly commit the highest kind of heresy it's unimaginable to me i think there's like two or three levels of heresy higher than human sacrifice I'm pretty yeah, sure to kill the cannibalism for... is up there to kill a man for the sorcerer king it is heresy And yes, I know I said his name wrong, but it was sort of a joke to John. <laughs> oh, uh, Caroline asked a question of jo of Joel on True, which is an amazing <laughs> Star Wars name, by the way. Okay, that's it actually that's actually the Romulan greeting, um, Joel on True. Oh, <laughs> but yes, you're not wrong. It is a good name. <laughs> Mind me to use that next time, just with a, as an in-joke with my Star Trek friends. Like, why did you name your character? You know, fuck it. <laughs> my name is Jolan True. We need to, we have, yes, my name is Jolan True. This is Kupla. This is, uh, I, I don't even know the vault. I can't speak Vulcan. That's the one language I can't really <clears throat> give a fuck about. <laughs> no, we are the only ones sentenced to guard these two orcs. Fuck. Oh shit, my glasses are kicking my fucking nose. <laughs> Fuck. No spells, no incantations. So someone could simply. Insight! The arm is obviously the ground. So Insight. Someone... You can definitely tell that the charm is definitely the ground. Can I roll Arcana? So it's part of uh, the pentagram. Yes. Real quick, can I roll Arcana? Actually, since you're close enough. Roll perception. Me? Or... No, well, the only person that's close enough. Yeah, me, right now. Uh, I'm also guess close who, enough. Guess whose expertise he's gonna I'm fail. No, close. I did good. 21, hell yeah. You notice that the pentagram is not perfectly sealed. Wait, I wouldn't to notice that. I'm gonna roll Arcana, because this is magic. Did I get anything from this? You can tell that the some of the Arcana is uh, leaking through it. Leaking. Mm. Uh, question. Define leaking. Can I do Arcana as well? Just so as in, like the seal that is on there is not perfectly. It's not perfectly sealed. Bef before he responds, can I roll Arcana real fast too? Sure. Okay, I got at least know what. It you notice exactly where the um cracks do I in the. Uh, pentagram that's on the ground where it's not perfectly drawn right that it's actually seeping through that can hole. I figure out the obvious I mean there's only so much you use a pentagram for am I able to draw conclusions about if it's supposed to like pentagrams for example like in like supernatural and any other thing they're used to summon things no no, no this is not the summon this is not a summon. This is literally just to contain. This is more like a barrier. Mm. It's a magic circle. It's a so, magic circle with a barrier that is imprecisely done to the point where it no, is. No, 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 no. I, I mean, it's the spell magic circle. Yeah. yeah. Sorry. I, 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 I know that spell doesn't have a very dis like unique name, but yeah. Very descriptive. I mean, so, it is very literal. Yeah, yeah, it is magic circle. It's supposed to. You can tell that it's supposed to keep the magic from the orbs in check, but you can tell that it's not working right. The only person who can tell where it's oh, actually no. coming from yeah. the, is the one who rolled the, the status on my uh, identify. That was only ten minutes. Was yes, minutes. I know. Yeah, let's say about now is when he yeah. figured out. Right? Oh yeah, it is. DM me that at your convenience, I guess. Okay, I can do that. You're right. This circle was poorly drawn. It's seeping power. Who drew this? 
Well, I guess it doesn't matter, but... Why is it like this? Once again, um, you find out he's It was made in humble. haste. Why? Oh. Question is, do we want to actually seal it or not? They said they sealed it in seal it. haste. No, what I'm saying the question is, do we want to actually seal this thing? I'm not done asking my questions. Why was it I'm sealed in haste? Worry about the world around them. Or the planes around them. So your the so the theory of your group was that these orbs would have a malicious effect on the material plane around them? Yes. And what made you think that? One controls time and the other one is straight up teleportation. Have they ever Don't know where it's gonna teleport me. I don't know where it teleports to. <clears throat> Have you ever seen any of these ill effects with your own eyes? Heard about them from any of your cohort? You're the one who just told me that the world outside hasn't... Moved in two days. Yes, well, we. Yeah. that's what I wanted to explain. We think this is because of that. He stops and thinks for a minute, and it's like, putting two and two together? Yeah, that makes perfect sense. Which means... This and it's been two has days been, for you, but you don't know about everybody. You don't know town, how long it's actually been for everybody else. You were here when this uh, <clears throat> pentagram was erected, yes? Yes. That means this town has been under this spell for nine years. For nine so years, time hasn't moved in this place. Are we talking about, like... So this artifact... Because this is the only bit I'm really hairy about. The rest of it, I understand what's going to happen. But the time stopping. That's time as a whole, including aging and all that other stuff here, right? Correct. That's going to be hell for someone who's been pregnant for nine years. <laughs> Do, but as far as we can tell, uh, has... The, the town just seemed to carry on its business as usual. No one seemed to really care notice and the priest the entire cathedral grounds above they have been corrupted is that like a, a rhetorical question towards jolon true over here or are we talking about like um, well yeah. i mean i like i'm asking i was wondering um, i didn't want to oh say anything because i was like i'm not for 100 percent sure who that was directed What's at or yeah. just in general He's just kind of saying it in general. Also, hey, Max, if you don't have any constructive criticism, shut the fuck up! He actually has been asking a question. They, uh... He actually was asking a question. I think he was saying that as more like, no, I have an actual question. Oh. Guys? I actually uh, were. Yeah. Well, I am kind of questioning this, but out of game. But didn't Luigi Cardona take a or over a year ago? Yes, which is a orb. Not orb. there's. For all we know, the orb of time was the first one brought here. Yeah. And for all we know, he hasn't returned with this orb yet. Yes. Either. And the time has been stuck for technically nine years. And it's Kadorna. And, uh, and, and, about uh, right. and additionally, according to this man, Kadorna is with the Sorcerer King. Whatever the fuck with the Sorcerer King means. Well, there is a time orb, and there's a tele teleportation orb. What does that fucking make? Control over, like, space-time? I, I, <laughs> and what yeah. does space-time do? It affects the natural order of the universe. the universe! Yeah. That's what she's saying. That's why she... Actually, no. Let's, let's carry more Eleanor. She's furious at that idea. Yeah, that's why, that's why we're so penitent about this, because this, these are very powerful things. This is the universe itself in the balance if I, here. 
if I can down uh, the boundaries uh, of the universe. I can say my uh, two cents here. It kind of sounds like this cult of the Sorcerer King has actually access to a magical time machine. Who left? Was that Rhythm Pot? That I was no idea. I, guess. I don't. I don't know. I'm assuming it's somebody born. Yeah. But no, like, here's the funny thing. For as unnatural as Eleanor would be if she's actually a vampire, she hates breaking up with the natural order of the universe. <laughs> yeah. She's one. Of, she's somebody who actually recognizes that's a bad thing, fucking guys. Come on. I gotta say, though. That doesn't mean much if he's been down here nine years and that happened afterwards. Some th that that's really the one piece of the puzzle with this town we're missing is the, what is up with that church yeah. and we have somebody who would probably know hmm. you're still gonna burn it down that's yeah it. yeah we're, we're gonna north yeah. dominant we're gonna um, yeah we're gonna cleanse the land with holy fire Notre Dame the power of Arctic. the power of God compels you, bitch. God and me on my side. Now what we what we need is just Darun to go in there with like fairy fire and just walk out the church burning, just laughing maniacally. <laughs> fairy fire doesn't do that, but okay. I know, I'm joking. Yeah, I know. But no, but I'm like I want Virgil to be sitting there like praying on his bed, just like Please bring us an angel. Meanwhile, fucking Madrid no, comes out of the burning church no, laughing. He, he's gonna like burn, he, no, <laughs> Virgil's going to burn it down because it has been corrupted. It is on an un, it is an unholy place that must be... But am I able to get an answer oh, from that uh, question? Sorry. John, John, what did I use the identify on? Did I use it on an orb? Yeah, I thought so. Okay, I use it on whatever they were telling me to use it on. I'm pretty sure you were using it on the orb. Okay. Well, there's two orbs. Is he using so, on, like, both orbs? So, I'm going to do it on the one that we're just going to do it on the one he sent me the thing for. I'm assuming I should just Google that, right? No, because it won't bring it up anything. It won't? Okay. No. Well, I've... identify tells me, like, what it does. I know. So, can I, can I, can I know what it does? I wonder if those orbs are used to be... Where the sorcery king is. Uh, it, it, I learned its properties and honestly, how to that wouldn't make any sense. How many charges it has, if any, what spells are affecting it, what they are, if the item was created by a spell. You I get the entire stat block, basically. Yeah. yeah. I basically uh -huh. learn every spell related feature to this item. Anything that would be in a Wikipedia. But no, I, yeah. sure, I'm gonna be honest, that, may, that wouldn't make any sense yeah. because. The Sorcerer King is alive, or at least exists still. Yeah. I'm not gonna say alive because he, he maybe exists in a. It could be like the it could be, like, it could be like the Witch King of Angmar. The Witch King's been dead, but like he he's around. Yeah. But um. Same with it wouldn't Sauron. make sense. He's like a big yeah. uh, tie like tower. Honestly, right? there's some there's probably just some. Then You're trying to gather orbs. I'm assuming the combined power from the orbs will create an effect desirable for them. Which sounds about cultist enough. <laughs> yep. And they already have two of them. And then this man... Says, and they could have a third already in their possession this, somewhere. Yeah, this man says Luigi, this man says Luigi is with the Sorcerer King. But we also have a letter stating that Luigi was sent out to gather an orb. We don't know if these are one of the orbs he got. Actually, I'm going to ask him a question. Another mm. question for the guy. Oh, uh, quite. He's got to answer mine first. Oh yeah, he's answered. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, was... Before you answer, before you ask. <laughs> yeah, answer Carrie's question, and then Virgil has a question. No, we have nobody outside of this tomb. <laughs> okay. Um, once again, I'm gonna insight this because that sounds like a lot of fucking bullshit. Okay, I know that's bullshit. That's if, if he, I, I can't possibly fail this that's without sus. it being a DC-30. Yeah. <laughs> X to doubt. <laughs> to his complete knowledge, 
the only people that were the only people that were sent to guard this was the group that you just slaughtered. He hasn't left. You all found out that he has not left this tomb in X amount of years. Nine years. So he has no idea what goes on the outside of here. Almost a decade. Okay, has anyone entered this tomb in the last nine years? Are you actually asking that question? Yes, I am, because that that's actually a pertinent question. Yeah, it's a great follow up. Has Luigi come here in the last nine years? Well, he would. There was a group of nine people that have that did try to enter here, but they didn't make it. And uh, what of Luigi? Has he not come here in the last nine years? No, Luigi's been here. So he has been here. Mm-hmm. Does he bring any either one of these two orbs here? Yes, he has. He did, did he? Which one? Only one that fits the description. Oh, yes. Uh, the only one that's kind of silky, blackish. Yeah, the one on the right. The teleportation orb. Ah. Uh, which explains that one. how... That explains how he managed to avoid whoever the fuck was after it, but... Hold on. Wait a minute. This is not a character, mind you, but hold on. They were after Luigi. So, we have three possibilities here. One, that whole fucking thing was just a facade for our benefit. Two, Luigi went fucking AWOL or those cults that we encountered were AWOL. Or three. I hear three. The only other one I can think of in that regard is that um... Yeah, I lost my train of thought there. I'm I have a fourth lie. proposition. I'm my proposition is that... Uh, because remember, when we originally fought those guys who were after Luigi, we originally didn't think they were cultists. We thought they were members of the mob. Then we learned there was a cult. We never confirmed that, though, that the cult and the guys who attacked us in that first town were part of the same organization. Wait a minute. Fuck. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. What? That's it. We already fought Luigi. Oh! What happened to the last motherfucker? Which orb was brought here? The teleportation orb. And I hit him in the leg. Oh my fucking god. I he disappeared Luigi here. That's exactly what happened. That was. <laughs> oh, fuck! That okay, was. I'm gonna, I'm, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm, mm, I, can't, I can't say it without. That okay, he already told us that was the orb of, of teleportation. Yeah, I'm gonna convey this in dialogue. All right, convey it. I'm dialogue. not gonna repeat the whole thing, but I'm gonna repeat it. All right, I can't believe this shit. <laughs> I hit Luigi Gadorne in the fuck. This is some X Files bullshit, man. I hit Luigi in the leg. No oh wonder, my... no wonder they were asking me like, "Hey, you're looking for Luigi Cadorna?" Because one of them was Luigi. Now, hold, hold on, hold on. Here's a question: the one that escaped, the one that escaped. Here's a question: I was that the was... one you talked to, or was that the one you fought? I think we took. I think the the one. I think we killed the one that you talked to, so yeah, you wouldn't no. recognize his voice. Yeah, no. That, the that one, guy the was... one that escaped. But she alternatively, was, the one that it escaped may... was hanging back the whole time. And However, alley. there we are making a very blind assumption that yeah. Luigi kept the orb the entire time, and it wasn't passed off to somebody else. I who then teleported away with the orb and brought yeah, it here. No. All we know is that Luigi is with. He sorcerer. said that both. Did Luigi only bring one or both orbs? I asked, but uh, I never he, got an answer on it. He only brought one. Which one? He points at it. This one? Yeah, that's really helpful. Yes. <laughs> the the, the teleportation, teleportation one? Orb. Okay, yeah. so yeah, that had to be in him. Someone else brought the time orb. 
Or it was originally here. Oh my fucking god, if I shot Luigi in the leg, I'ma flip my shit. Cause he owes me a goddamn crossbow bolt. Cause remember, John, I asked, is my crossbow bolt there? You said, no. Luigi took my crossbow bolt. Oh my god, I am freaking out. I never saw this shit coming. Uh, oh. <clears throat> oh. I shot Luigi Gadorma. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get a goddamn custom t-shirt for that shit. I shot Luigi Gadorna in DD with parentheses. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's why. <laughs> oh, Bass. You should have seen if you could recognize some of them. Well, to be oh, fair, job. I'm going to guess that some of them were probably. <laughs> I think I'm they're here. not going to be able to afford the information. That's all I can say. This is this is like a collector's item. Yeah, I know. Like I have information out of character, I just can't use it. <laughs> it's yeah. annoying me. Like no. No, <laughs> I have to is, tread very carefully. This is, this is also developing into a I'm not going to say what the fuck this is because you idiots will abuse the fuck out of it. And probably explode while doing so. She would destroy it if it meant killing herself. I don't think you're able to. Yeah, I know you can't. All right, I'm gonna, all right. No, I know you, I'm, I'm, mm, trust me, I have, I know. I'm gonna, now I'm gonna say this line about the disappearing man. The one I shot. That was his, that was him, wasn't him? shot in the fucking leg with a crossbow ball. He was wounded. That much we knew. Yeah. I'm just saying it out of, you know, character, but yeah, I, you guys clearly saw me shoot that crossbow ball Pro and I, yeah. and I uh, promise, yeah. I said as soon yeah, as yeah, we, yeah, 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 I, yeah. Mm -hmm. I hit him and he's yeah, gone. Yeah. Crossbow, crossbow wound specifically. Well, I doubt he would probably would have, unless he examined the wound himself. I doubt he would have no, he wouldn't that. notice that part. Yeah, he would at least know he was wounded in some way, I'm sure. Yeah, I'm you, like, you, you can tell, tell the difference between, was... like, a, between like, a, like a, hey, uh, a slashing thing between and a Between a crossbow penetrate. and a bow and arrow. Oh, like a regular arrow. Okay, okay. 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 I'm going to hey, simplify quick, it quick, then. Quick, 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 quick question. John, can you put that in English, please? Sure. You missed, like, half the words in that sentence, and I... I right. honestly cannot understand it very well. All right, I'm going to rephrase that then. Uh, wow, corrupted. <laughs> no, no, but before the word will, uh, both, literally both times. Right. Just I, before the word, you forgot like a pronoun. I'm going okay, to I'm going to rephrase my question then. <laughs> Damage from a missile? I, 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 I think it's kind of wound. But he was wounded. Yes, he was wounded when he came here, but... I didn't examine been. the wound, so I couldn't tell you what it was. It must have been. It must have been. <clears throat> him. Uh, it just sounds like damn a it above, it must have been him. He played us like a damn fiddle. I want everything. Honestly, uh, though, that that uh, doesn't sound like too bad of a drawback, TBH. It's not. Assuming the second, well, I, it's not like a complete sentence, so I'm like, the second part doesn't. I know, no, you're good, you're good. Yeah. Sorry, I was quickly typing it and I know, doing other I things. So I brought it up. Changes it could be important. Like, if time. you add a word, it's really bad, but, you know. If he brought that orb here, that means they can be taken. 
There's two orbs here, right? So I'd have to yes. identify on the other one too. Fuck. Luigi fucking Ghidorna. Fuck. These, or these orbs can't be left here. They either have to be taken with us okay. or buried. Okay. So so basically, once you do the thing with it, you uh, it it. Uh, you can't let go. Like no. Well, it's a, it, well it, no. It, it will always be with your within your yeah. possession. Yeah. Okay. It's it's the it's the one ring. <clears throat> Got it. Carrie, we can't just leave them here. Wait. Either... Hmm? All right. No, so, John, I think at this point, I'm going to also have to cast Identify on the other orb, since there's two orbs. Okay. And the party's going to want me to do both. Well, yeah. first, I got to watch you both. Yeah. Actually, they're uh, probably presuming that you're doing both. Yes. How big is the orb, though? Actually, that's a great question. That is a very good question. Is it, like, yeah. hand-sized, pocket-sized? Uh, not pocketable. It's the size of a raw <laughs> softball so it is pocketable yeah i mean book bag wise yes okay so when I... you say pocketable i think you can fit in literally pockets <laughs> darun you've been presented with two of the most powerful things you've ever seen in your life things that control right. the fabric of the fucking universe and you're just I'm like i'm going to uh Identify the other one. I'm going to identify the other one, but if anyone gets near the uh, the one I have identified, I am going to glare and hiss at them. <laughs> okay. Because if they touch that, I'm not responsible for what happens to them. A very <laughs> ill fortune. Yeah. Shotgun in the leg. I mean, Carrie, we can't we can't just leave them here. Well, you aren't leaving them unsafe. You take care of that church. Oh my god. I like how they're coming out of a plan what do them. They don't even know what they fucking do. <sighs> I know. Like, guys, I don't. The wait. name alone guys, makes it where Wait like, you don't for the touch. wizard to finish fucking identifying. For and the one you know, who won't share information. I am not done paid. with both of them yet. But you're not. You won't reveal it without. You know that for paid. sure? For certain? She might have just that? been doing it for a meme. It might have just no. been a bit. It's more of a, if it's not pertinent, I'm not telling you. But if it's really fucking pertinent, I'm not holding the time bomb. All right. So I'd be telling you. Is he okay. holding it? <laughs> yeah. uh, it's also because both of these are probably cursed in some way, shape, or form. So if you just go picking them up and trying to dispose of them, you're probably screwing yourself. And when... And when Kadorna came here, and you, when Kadorna came here, it, uh, you said he is with the Sorcerer King currently, but yeah. did, uh, did you tell him where he was, did you perhaps learn where he was going after he left this place? Not a clue. He left we were told that he is to meet the king. He left the teleportation. He couldn't have gotten far. Did you just say teleportation couldn't got far? Yeah, he did. Well, he did. No. Well, <laughs> no, no, theoretically he speaking, he, he got teleportation from the orb, not by himself. Yeah, uh, okay. Theoretically <laughs> guys, say, no, no, I just wanted to make sure I heard that correct. <laughs> you just, you just <laughs> teleportation <laughs> so guys. he couldn't have gotten far because it's there. He left it. Guys, all I'm saying is <clears throat> like i'm gonna be with you guys just wait for the second identify to be done the first orb is one what thing what do you and think i'm doing <laughs> i know we're just going through dialogue options can you guys anyway. just like quietly twiddle your thumbs and not <clears throat> say anything else so we can just be like tell me what the other orb is and i can explain it to the party slightly all right but we wait so we, I I'll press, give you the free trial version i press back on my <laughs> xbox controller and wait 10 minutes Dude, everyone knows it's X to skip. I, I... Okay. Well, uh, which one's the red orb? The one on the left or the one on the right? Say so, what? That one one more time? The the reddish orb that you said. Um. Is it on the left or the right? Oh, actually, I mixed them up, so they're supposed to be opposite of each other. But yeah. Okay. <clears throat> uh, I didn't hear if it was left or right. So cool. Oh. Um... Say left. Okay. So the orb on the right, guys. 
that's off limits, and if any of you touch it, you'll probably die. Is that how the did, time one? How did yes. Luigi so, touch it? Then? Okay. No, no, the time, the time orb, not the teleport one. Oh, that's yeah, the one on the, the left. You can touch the he space orb up. because that. But just wait, no, moves wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You touch the time orb. I mixed uh, up. When I, gave you the, when I gave you the information, I mixed up the colors. My okay. Bad. Okay, okay so, so we're gonna recon to where the color of the orb that we found again. No, no, I'm crack. just how I'm gonna reword it to Maverick and have him fix the colors. But okay. what? Okay, but so, what, so which, what, which one is... is on the right, time is on the left. Yeah, okay. that works. So the guys, what I want to say is the time orb. This, I'm gonna tell you the pertinent information here. That one is horribly, disgustingly cursed. No, really. Uh, it's also easily fixable. If we have the right spell, yes. which uh, I don't think the divines will acquire coins. Uh, but... Um, good question. Actually, I'm gonna see, look that up real fast. I'm not a cleric. Divine soul sorcerer. Divine soul sorcerer Sorry. has cleric bit properties. So yes. That's, uh... that's... Real quick, I'm gonna look up what spell it is real quick, just so I I understand what exactly he needs. Uh, the one that removes <laughs> curses. Uh... No, 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 that wouldn't. Oh, I mean, technically it would help, but not not exactly what we need. Okay, what about the one? Right. Of, anything else? Oh no no, I'm gonna give you the brief right, rundown well, on the curse because that one's actually harmful. Okay. Uh, if you use the time orb. It desecrates you and the land you are standing on. And the more times you use it, the worse the effect. What so, does it is do? that why the church is desecrated? Because someone time. used this near the church? No, because it's leaking! The time orb's no, desecration no, no. is... No, no, no. Baz, no. The he, word, he says no, if you the word use it, use. it desecrates. Okay. Yeah, if you use it at all, which you do so by touching and thinking you should use it. But uh, that part I'm only heavily alluding to. Okay. So So it if it's be, if you use said orb, it desecrates the immediate vicinity. Yeah, and yourself. Which bad. If you want a colorful graphic explanation, think of yourself as a healthy flesh and blood person. You use the orb. Suddenly, you have early onset schizophrenia and your skin's decaying. Uh, and then you use it again and you have Alzheimer's and dementia define, and your define, bones are showing through your skin. Define using the time Ask orb. Something. You using use it in any way you perform. To alter time. Okay, so and you get it, so it officially can be used to fuck with like you can take the orb and fuck with time. Okay. Temporarily. What about the? Something. Oh yeah, Max asked you a question. What? Uh, if Baz touched it enough, would he become a Cthulhu monster? I mean, yeah. he would probably die. So, first. what is the actual? Okay, the power of the actual orb of time. Can you be more specific? You about can. What you can stop time. You can make time go fast. Can you go backwards? You can cast time stop. But you um, can't go backwards. I mean, as far as I was told, probably not, but John... Okay, I just wanted to know in general, because it's nice yeah. to know. Basically, it, it can stop time. Okay. That's what it does. Okay. Either, like, the time stop spell, so it's just, like, just you and, you know, the smaller area, or, like, you know, the town for nine years. Or tell... Okay, so tell us about... The teleportation. Oh, uh, that one's off limits because you will accidentally just kill yourself if you touch it. <clears throat> just define. No, no. I <laughs> if I define it, you'll accidentally do it. No, that's not how that yes. works. Yes. Um. Actually... Unironically, Thaz, if I tell you how it works and your character accidentally interacts with it, knowing that's how it works. It would then what trigger the and the very knowledge. No, no, no. The very no, no, no. Jeff, Jeff. Let me explain it this way. The very knowledge. It's a changes. mimetic hazard. No, no, no. If I don't tell you how it works and what it does, you're less likely to accidentally use it. That's not a joke. The teleportation one was the one that I kind of knew about. 
Uh, what I can say, <laughs> and I'll give you all a hint here, Kadorna didn't touch this at all. It's been unused. What the fuck? And or, if it has been used, Kadorna died. I doubt he's dead. That would make sense. He would. Yeah. He would have. They said no. they saw Kadorna come in here wounded. However, <laughs> however, that doesn't mean he's not around. Doesn't no, what I will say is we need a bag of holding as fast as we really can for at least the time warp. Uh, the the dimension traveling warp, I'll hold on to uh, for safekeeping uh, if if uh, we need to. So just to clarify, if he did use this, he would have died. No. To clarify, if he did use the time orb, and the time orb is currently sitting in front of us without him being here, he would have died. No, 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 no. you misunderstand. We believe <clears throat> he used the time orb. No, to... the teleportation orb. No, the teleportation not, 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 orb. Yeah, not the, te not the time orb. The teleportation orb to get here uh -huh. from that yeah. other town we are in. Uh -huh. And then he left the orb here. So what I'm going to heavily imply is if that if he used the orb, the orb could not have been left here. Oh, so it's soul by not him. unless not unless that same spell you talk about was used. No, no, he would have had no. died. Wait, okay, so it's soul binding. Not entirely, and I do really do not want to have to explain it. <laughs> Like, um, if you knew, you'd know why I'm not telling you. Because what my character will say is Trisfarin is the only person in this party that holds the minimum absolute risk of accidentally getting themselves killed with this orb. Is your oh. children shooting the, throws? The time, no, no. The time orb, it has nothing to do with saving throws. The time orb, <clears throat> if you use it, it causes desecration. You could treat that with a cleric or something. It's not immediately dangerous to you. Mm -hmm. It's dangerous over time. The the teleportation <laughs> planar manipulation orb is straight up hazardous. Yeah, because how it's activated, if I told you, you'd understand. I just um... can't because if you knew, it'd be an issue. So it's not if you knew how to if you knew what the activation of it was. I take yeah, it it's the likelihood not a of you activating it. I take it it's not a simple touch. High. Then, I take it. You, maybe... Oh, Baz, it's so ridiculously easy to use. It that's why it's dangerous. So All right, our... now I understand. Now I understand. Yeah, that's what we're trying to allude to. Yeah. So theory. So our theory just doesn't work at all. No. Mm. Uh, but it, we still look, have proof no, no. that Luigi. Yeah. Did uh, I will say. I will say. No, like, we don't. No, no. Trisvarian is basically going to tell the whole party, you're not allowed to handle these orbs without wearing, like, gloves or something. So you're not actually touching them. Maybe, like, put them in a sling so you're also not technically holding them either. Really what I'm saying is I should learn Tenzer's floating disc to hold carries around. <laughs> like... Or may chance. <laughs> the less no they're too heavy for mage hand oh really okay yeah mage hand is five pounds yep the oh, less physical like touching of these orbs the better we will be but the, safer you all will be. <laughs> the planar manipulation <clears throat> orb is under tristarian's care like that's going in my backpack and it's not under argument because like trust the wizard the wizard said don't touch this Just this is this is Come gandalf on. telling that, like don't fuck with, don't use the ring so the one that's actually mildly okay to handle is the is the desecrate and slowly rot your like brain and like your your mind and body yeah you know the, the one that effectively turns you into a ghoul from fallout is the safer one yeah that's the time orb yeah uh and it is theorized that if we just took the orb out of the town the the orb would make the town go back to normal But we'd have. But the other thing is that that orb, wherever we go, wouldn't time be still wherever we went with that orb. No. Or no. is it just cast an localized field, and once you go outside a localized field with said thing, it um, stops? 
how it was explained to me is if we move the orb out of the town, the town will go back to normal. Well, the town will age nine years. Instantly? That'd be really awkward, actually. Ooh, Man, yeah. can you imagine being a kid forever and then suddenly... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, you're... Now, you're 15 That's just now. That's creepy. No, I feel bad for anyone who's pregnant right now. Yeah. How to kill your mother in childbirth. Let <laughs> two electric boogaloo. Yeah. So um. And the other thing is, is who is ever who is also elderly in this town is probably going to die. So it is safe and sound, able to touch the time orb. As long as you don't use it, no problems whatsoever. Yeah, and that one is harder to accidentally use because you have to willfully try and stop time. Mm. Okay. So so long as you do not the try planar to stop orb, time with it. Yeah, it the, the planar orb, on the other hand, doesn't care if you wanted to use it. It'll simply use itself. Oh, it has like a mind of its own. They're cursed artifacts. They're basically sentient. Basically, yeah. That's why the elf that doesn't technically sleep is holding the, the planar orb. Okay, so we're gonna what we've established that Virgil's gonna be fucking pippin' and try and take the fucking orb and stare at it. No, he's not gonna Why would he ever do that? Yeah. Why would Pippin stare at the fucking it's 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 I can't even actually think of what the fuck that thing's called. The Palantir. The Palantir. No, okay, don't, no, 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 fuck you. It's Palantir. <laughs> guys. Nerd! Guys. Yo. No, no, no. It's not you a nerd off. thing. It's a Palantir. It's one of, like, three or four <clears throat> that let them basically have, like... Uh, there was one in Minas Tirith. Uh, one yeah, it, at... Yeah, it, it lets them gaze, like, other Marvel. on the other side of the continent. I believe there are five. It's a scrying portal. That's all yeah. it is. It's yeah. Just, if you scry in the portal too long, it scries some really <coughs> weird things. Uh, I believe there were five. Seven. There were seven stones. Oh, that shit. makes sense. So what do we there do? There was one. Um, probably either put these in like knapsacks so we're not like holding them, or a bag of holding. If uh, anyone has one handy. I don't have a bag of holding. Nobody's no, bought one. Does anyone uh, know how much those cost? Hundred. Uh, yeah. I mean, if we pulled our money together, we could get a bag of holding, throw these babies in them. That, mm, bag they're, of holding, I think, are rare <laughs> objects. They're, they're, they're rare. Uh, bag, bags of holding are uncommon, uh, actually. Really? Oh, uh-huh. So that's a basic, that's still a basic like, bag of holding is uncommon. I believe it's still uh, at least 500. Is that, is that what no, we went over before? They're, they're like the most common, uncommon item. They border on common. Point is, how yeah. hard would it be for us to acquire one of those? In this town? Yes. Not gonna happen. In this no. economy? Fuck. At this so, time of yeah. year? Localized <laughs> entirely <laughs> in this dungeon? <laughs> yes. Me and Steve literally have a treasury. Oh, wait a second. Oh yeah, no, that's very useful for us. Six uh, like six days behind hey, in another part of the country. John, I can we go back down the kebab? I have two other very pertinent questions. Back again. Alright, one second. That's like if I lived in Flo that's like if I lived in Kansas and it Couldn't was like my Hey, email? my friend in Oregon can uh, pay for this. Hey, George. What? Remember how my EA account got banned yeah. yeah i i don't have the right to appeal the ban no you don't welcome to ea yeah so i just lost my ea account cool yep i got mm -hmm. hacked and they're like oh you got hacked too bad Good. say goodbye to being able to play our games <laughs> what games did you lose uh really just apex legends but <laughs> I mean, it does mean that in the future, if I ever want to play any of their games, I yeah. cannot do the multiplayer. If we're not getting a bag of holding in this town, that means we're just gonna either have to cave this bitch in or hold these in like a knapsack. We hold them. 
And then we cave it in. Geez. Make them think that we sealed it in. Get them I get won't in be and go. Able oh. To play multiplayer for kind of smart, yeah. Honor, Star Wars Squadron. All right. Well, then we must we must make a pact here to never use these fucking things. None of us can we will we all agree to never use these for ill purposes? So for Ill I purposes? mean, they likely. You said kill ill us, purposes, so... correct? No. Right. Okay. You said let me ill refine, purposes. Let me refine that. <laughs> Let me refine yeah, that. I look at the cost of the uncommon, uh, which is technically what a bag of holding falls into. I'll say it's, it's 110. Yep. This would be at the average going All right. price. Um, but as an aside, real quick, John, do you want me to, to unify the party or just leave the split for now? That was my <laughs> motive for asking those two questions, by the way. I know. I know. <laughs> do you want. All right. Yeah, I want to say, uh, so, Virgil was going to ask, like, like, basically, okay, if we are going to take the orbs and put them into sacks, I say before we do anything, we each, every one of us, swear an oath never to use these horrible things. That's awkward. Uh, yeah, that's very awkward. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm gonna let you guys swear that oath. Uh, I'll do it on the time one. But the planar manipulation one has quite a few um, possible benefits for our immediate situation. You said, hey, this artifact is dangerous. Don't use it, but also I can use it. But only No, I said if anyone but an elf uses it, you're fucked. And because... he's the only elf. No, because I said elves don't sleep. Clear. Elf Just touching the orb dream. of time is fine. Yeah. No, no. Elves, do... elves okay. don't dream. You can technically touch it, but if you touch it and simply, you know have a thought in your head you could accidentally use it that's the time warp not the television no that's no the that's the planar orb yeah yeah it's the but planar the, orb so the time, the time orb, orb is safe you have touch. to actually okay you have to actually the, want the time one you literally have to <coughs> think about using yeah you have to consciously i thought this i thought this was appropriate it. i figured this was appropriate time to mind time fuck. Warp. now this is a perfect time to mind fuck uh virgil even more <laughs> yeah. So, so no one's gonna swear the oath not to use the orbs. Uh, the time orb is. Yeah. No, we're all gonna Shh. not use the time orb. Yeah. That's Unless... one that I think. And he said the part... teleportation orb has a mind of its own, so it might just teleport us because fuck you. Well, we might not have full here. control over if, that. If you even think about such thing, it will might it might actually activate. Right. Type deal. So. Yes. John, just think I, that in your head. One second. Mm -hmm. Can I explain to them out of character what it does just so I can stop getting this, like, fifth pedantic questioning? <laughs> if they all promise not to use it in character. Well, I they're swear. not touching the orb in character to be H. Yeah. My character's not letting go. Of, uh, my character's a very good plan to not have to let go of the orb. Yeah, if they all promise not to actually okay. use it out of character or use it in character, then yes. <coughs> okay. But well, I can't not... technically stop you from telling well, no, no. anything. Yeah, but what I'm trying to say here is, out of character, if you think of a person or a place and going to them while you're holding the orb without, like, like bare skin holding the orb, it takes you and the nearby people to that place or location. <laughs> and it works if you're asleep and dreaming. And when yep. you're not conscious... If you try to throw it away or used it, it brings itself back into your held possession. So if you use it and fall asleep, and then you dream of, you know, George John's example was the ninth pit of the abyss. You wake up in the ninth pit of the abyss. Like I said, if the thought even crosses your mind of going somewhere, it will take you there. Well, that's why the <laughs> yes, elf, that's, and it I, may that's the best way to explain it with you. Yeah, yes. that's why the elf who doesn't technically dream. Dream. You sleep but, or you trance, but you don't dream. It, it's trance, which is just oh, pretend, like it's God. like doing multiplication table okay. in your sleep. Mm -hmm. All right, yeah, 
Basically, if you yeet the orb of time to Brindle, he will instantly be whole. No, no, yes. that's the yes, yes, yes. That's the, the point. The orb of now. teleportation that time. Yeah, yeah. The, it, that's also why my character. For instance, if Brindle her, ever touched it, he would be in Parak Doom immediately. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's that's also why my character can. But then again, her. he might not be there seven hours later when he falls asleep. Yeah. Yeah. Real quick, yeah, no, uh, that, that's why my character your... couldn't confirm that George. it. Uh... It's already happened. What are you talking about? George, I already did it. Are you gonna change your uh, your character? Picture. I Picture. just did. I oh, I, okay. I guess I have to read. Well, no. Well, uh, on the board, no, not really. It's not worth it at okay. the moment. So, so what I was trying to say here, though, is why the elf one mm. is go is the only one uh, who's he. By the way, is the only one deeming himself the the only one to hold it. Is because, say for example, we went and we're like, man, how do we get both these orbs out of this town without us getting in caught in this big commotion? While also getting, I don't know, a really sweet way to try and get a bag of holding. Can you guys put two and two together? Yeah. We plane shift to Brindle. Do, 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 do. What? Wait, are we actually gonna plane we, ship? Do you even have that spell, or are you gonna use the orb? We the can't, orb we can't lets do that. you go to any but person. But you would. I but, would have be stuck with it following me. But you said it could potentially kill you. If the you, only time, okay, the way it would kill you is if, is if you, you were you like sleeping. Of a place. Which is why the elf, the person who doesn't have that risk of it teleporting me in their sleep. Is the only one who can use it. He's don't they get visions when they go into trance, though? Hmm. No, they don't actually technically dream. They don't have to no. technically dream. And even then, in trance, you're still semi like conscious. You're semi conscious, yeah. You're you're not incapacitated, so you would still be aware if it tried to appear in your uh, hands or not. Theoretically speaking, if Maverick had the alert feet, he'd be the con. He he would never have. To. He's basically always. I mean, Second Able way to up at, uh, at level four at is the, the feat I do go. By the way, oh, you are going. <coughs> oh, you are going alert. Yes, I'm playing Fuck a stealth yeah. character. I don't hey, hey, hey! Game. I'm not disagreeing with you. I'm not. But here's the thing. Um, he's more shocked. Uh, yeah, is anyone gonna actually? Is anyone gonna respond to this shit? Because this I was is gonna, like mind fucking the other half quick, of the party, I was gonna. Probably. I was gonna. <laughs> ask oh, my character you were, known the whole time. Oh yeah, really I know your character. I was gonna knew. ask when you guys were done having your rules <laughs> argument. Okay, it wasn't a rules argument. It's All true. this was out of game, by the way. Yeah, so. this was yeah, out of yeah, character. Obviously, obviously. I know, but I I, I only uh, speak yeah. in character, so I'm not gonna over. I'm not gonna okay. interrupt you guys. If you guys but it is known in character that I can touch that orb. Yeah. Okay. So. Yeah, everyone can touch the time orb. So y'all wanna shape sh uh, plane shift to Brindle? <laughs> well, I was saying it's two birds of one stone. Three birds, actually. I guess out of the What town. is that even meant to? What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> Jerome like, doesn't want to get it, monster it. cancer or be teleported to space in his sleep. Fair enough. <laughs> no, yeah, you oh, guys no. Are also Jesus of Christ, the... there's a CBS TV show on with where people are wearing the masks and shit. God damn it, yeah. we've, hit, we've hit that culture. <laughs> <We're Yeah>. on... <laughs> no, you guys are also forgetting about the part where if you dreamed of a volcano in your sleep, you'd die. Yeah. Yeah, but now do you see why the elf's like, don't you touch this, you fucking idiot? Why do you, okay, like I said, why do you think I was holding Jeff back from doing it? She was willing to fucking attack him if he tried to do it. Okay. So. Because. Onto her problem. The sad part is that Eleanor actually fears these orbs utterly. Virgil is kind of horrified. I don't think he's at fear yet. <laughs> okay. Uh, but back back in character. Yeah, here. he's got he's kinda of horrified that by the fact that they do that like these are powerful oh. objects. They Sorry. should they go against like the laws of Sorry. all that is sacred in the universe, you um, know? I do have one last question, John. Hmm. You you do in have to like be holding them with like bare skin, right? No. No. They work through gloves. Oh okay. But what if oh. you had two layers of gloves? <laughs> Still work. It's okay. As long as you're somehow physically touching it, even if you have something in between you. If it was in your backpack? Then it would be okay. Okay. 
I'm going to immediately put the planar manipulation one in the backpack. Also, do you guys want to want to hear the fun story on why I have performance and survival proficiencies? Alright. I forgot my character was a folk hero. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he, he's a folk hero uh, militia leader. Wait, you were a militia leader in the past? He, huh? He led a militia to fight off an invading army, yes. That was his... Uh, his his origin <laughs> yep. story was he mm -hmm. let them. So wait, wait, stuff. we have an actual officer in the, in the in this party, and we let you be in charge. Yeah, God you, damn it. you like let, you know what? Let's give it. Let's give it to the to like the to like the middle class. Like, how well, old guys, is Maverick's character? Guys, just out of character, it's a folk hero. Uh, I mean, it's a high elf, so like ages. Hundred years. Oh, oh, hundred at least fifteen. I went with seventy-two actually. The oh, thing is, I feel like young. Trisferian's so you the are most, young. Yeah. Trisferian's like the most qualified to lead us, but he also thinks it would be funnier if he oh, wasn't. Wait, does fifth edition have different rules when elves for time for ages? That that's uh, like I believe it's young adult. years, like for, very young uh, like adult. maximum age. I think it's nine hundred years. They're max. an average lifespan of seven to eight. Dwarves are four to five. Humans are eighty to one hundred and twenty. Yeah, but yes, I have different roles. Yeah. But no, I was like, because average adventuring age would be like 115. It depends. Uh, I, that that still is big, like average, but average for so humans. Technically, is like, you would be like. No, no, average average for humans is in like 18. mid 20s, early 30s. Yeah, so well, you would be in human years. You would be technically like 15. No, it, it'd be like 20 ish equivalent in human years. Yes, because you gotta also figure out. You also gotta keep in mind when they mature yeah i no no no. i understand the maturity part but yeah. no i was figuring like an average adventurer not nah, like 15 would be 20. just varian's the target demographic for a, a young adult novel yeah yeah he's well, basically like uh, what's protagonist <laughs> they f they physically mature about the same age as humans yes, that's do. the thing so it doesn't really after you hit like twenty, it doesn't really give, matter all that much. Nope. So basically, he's been twenty for the past century. Well, to be fair, elves look young as fuck forever. <laughs> no, no, he still, he still, as... he still looks like Orlando Bloom. Yeah. As as far as like age is concerned, he's like the equivalent of like a like nineteen twenty year old. Yeah. I want to say something uh, really fun. When I was watching Fellowship with my roommate, I said, you know, we're about to meet Elrond, played by Hugo Weaving, and when he sees Elrond, he's like, you know, I'm really glad this man is named Hugo Weaving, because he really looks like he would be named Hugo Weaving. <laughs> <laughs> he does, doesn't he? Like, he doesn't yeah. look like... You no, know, he looks he... like a Hugo... Like, it, there is no other guy who could be named Hugo Weaving. Like, it's just that guy. Now, you want to be really shocked? Mm. Look at what it looked like in uh, the movie Daylight. Hmm. Can't imagine that. I don't know. Maybe I'm too tired. He looks very, very, like, Fierce. super young in yep. the movie Daylight, which is yeah. not a very good movie, by the way. Yeah. No, it's just not. Just remember, <laughs> just remember, there is a tabletop war game that's Lord of the Rings. Operated by Games Workshop, we can technically <clears throat> play Lord of the Lord of the Rings tabletop war game. Yes, you can. Yeah, but oh, Warhammer! It's probably like two hundred just to. Start no, that's game. actually the cheapest of Games Workshop's tabletop sets to get into. Oh, nice! It's yeah, it is like cheap. twenty to forty bucks for a, a, like a pack. And of you unit. can also use most of the <coughs> models for D and D. Exactly, but I want to point out here the the pack of units. For like Gondor or most of the other factions are Oh no, that's vegan Morgan. I'll say for Gondor. It's game. eight swordsmen, eight spearmen, eight archers. Which is that plus one captain is more than like the average number of points you would use. So it's straight mm -hmm. up like forty bucks to get into. Damn. 
compared to other Games Workshop games. So how big is this orb? Yeah. Fucking 50 bucks, and you need 20 of them. John? Hmm? How big is this orb? The the time Uh, orb? Softball. Size of a softball. Sorry, I was thinking of Viggo Morganson. Imagine you're holding the apple in Assassin's Creed. So so basically, uh, the wizard is allowing all of you to do what you want with the time warp. He really doesn't care. So what I need to do is I need to to change into Avery Brooks from Deep Space Nine and just fiddle around (laughs) with the thing like a fucking baseball. All right, I'm going to respond to the next Um, line. Trisfarian said he'd handle that one. No. Oh, no. Now I have one last thing to deal with myself. And I turn to the uh to the cultist. I have one last question for you, Mr. True. Tell me. What brought you here? Um This is the only place that I felt that I was accepted. Why? Ran out of my hometown. Um. Take him out. Lost my wife. And um... And then just wandered and then found here. Now... If I let you go, what's to make me think you wouldn't just run back and report everything that's happened here? Well, you just told me it's been nine years. I wouldn't know where to run to. Nowhere to go. Guys, for all we know, we get rid of the time warp and he dies from sudden heart attack. Mm. She makes a good point, would you? How the fuck would he know he died of a sudden heart attack? (laughs) You don't know. He has a clogged artery. He wouldn't have a clue that he had it. He has a clogged artery and it ages nine years to an unfunctioning status. He wouldn't know. Technically, he would because I don't think his bodily functions would cease. Without logic, he would never get hungry. If that's the case. Is that what's what's happening? It doesn't age. You yeah, know, his, his cells aren't degrading. But his blood still has to pump. Yeah, his blood is pumping, but his cells aren't aging. They're not degrading. Yeah, that's a completely different... Okay, guys, it was a joke. We don't need to take Basically, I... like, he wouldn't get... Like, if he had cancer, his cancer would cease to multiply. He would be stuck eternally at that... Yeah. At, and then, nine years, bam. Terminal but, cancer. Terminal uh man don't you hate it when you're just relaxing and then suddenly bam oh we went completely different directions (laughs) final destination anyway (laughs) um (laughs) what's the cultist response uh to what question uh the one at all All of them All I'm saying is, Bertrand made us not be sure it will make him your manservant. Just a thought. Pass. Can you explain that a little bit more? <laughs> Would you I... rejoin the cult? <clears throat> Bullish what? Enterprise. I what wouldn't if... know where they were. Oh. Okay. Real quick, out of character, what if I was like, I believe you owe me what is called a life debt. <clears throat> He has no idea where his <laughs> cult is, so he couldn't what? rejoin them. Technically, if you wanted to go that way, I'm the one who captured him. Uh, we'll just take his number for uh, spell materials later. Hmm. I don't know how many spells you use blood. <laughs> no, 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 no. That's, no, no. The, that's component. The, the body. <laughs> I know. You can use him to create a clone army. 
<laughs> a clone army. I mean, no, a the clone spell did required. The council like, authorized the creation of a clone army. And I, didn't <laughs> I was reading the wrong we're question. Sorry, like, we're sorry. I didn't realize my uh, chat was not scrolling down. Wait, which which one did you ask? Uh, which one did you answer then? I didn't. No, no, no. I was the reason why I said, "Could you specify?" Because I was like reading it. And I was like, "That doesn't oh. really." Make yeah, I was any like, I, I'm like, uh, I, I, is it not obvious? <laughs> <laughs> the, the one I was reading, I was like, that doesn't really require me to make yeah, an answer. Right. But yeah, but that, that doesn't actually answer the question. Just, I mean, just saying, well, I wouldn't know where they're at does I, not answer the question. As far as I understand, he, what he's trying to say is, I, even if I wanted to rejoin the cult, I would But that's not what he said. That's not what he no, said. No, that's though. what he is in implying. I wouldn't, I would rejoin them, but I wouldn't know where to look. Hmm. He might as well come with us. Just out of game. <laughs> I mean, I was thinking on saying like, uh, I I I made the joke about yeah, like the life debt, like <coughs> we spared your life. Uh, we, we could yeah take him with us. Oh. Well. Randomly roll for that one. Not that I'm actually suggesting that, though. Because I'm, I'm not sure. The morality sounds kind of iffy. Sounds, it sounds kind of like slavery light. But we get an NPC. That just sounds like slavery with extra steps. Yeah. It's not, you're the one who says we need the people. He is one of the people. He's one a weird star. Well, I, He's not one of the people. He's a cultist. He is I mean, sub people. He is technically one of the pe like. I he could actually. I could try to offer this man a different path. Exactly. He should talk a demographic. He should join the crew. Yeah. Part of the crew, part of the ship, part of the crew, oh, yeah. part of the I'm ship. I'm going to ask him a question. <laughs> I have a question. You well, said hold on, because I have a question oh, yeah, oh, yeah, that I already yeah, have posed. Yeah. Yep. Okay, I have a question after your question. Oh, I got uh, this. I, got I this. am not lying to you. I would rejoin them, but I do not know where to find them. Um, The question is... You know what? Fuck it. At this point in time, I have... A 17 passive insight. Is he lying? No. Okay. I'm gonna ask him. I didn't feel like rolling for that. He one. literally, <laughs> you can tell that he's like deep in All thought, right. thinking of where to begin. But he's like. I'm gonna ask him know. a question. You you say you joined because there was nowhere else to go, hmm? Yes. And that is why you would go back still. Yes. What if there were a different path in this life? Okay, so we leave the crypt. I turn Everything. to the, I turn to the man, I say, You understand what you're to do, yes? I understand. Uh, find the cleric, reconsecrate the temple. Yeah they are. Very good. Don't think we should burn it down. <laughs> you don't think what should happen? No, I think he I said still, I, I still think, think we should burn it down. Sorry, sorry, can you repeat that for the, uh, the camera? For <laughs> the I camera. I think we should burn it down. That almost sounds like heresy. Okay, that sounds... Hot take, hot take. That sounds like a reportable offense. You could go um, to church court for that. Yeah. Church court? No, church courts. The real institution. Should do mass murder like Vikings. Uh -huh. Is it, of course, Technically, it's... you are going to. But... No, let's get out of here. No, no, we we have to take him to uh, a court first. I'm sorry. <laughs> so uh, we leave the town. Is is there any incident, or are we just allowed to leave? I you are completely allowed to leave. No. All right. But and where are we going to? Like, let's just we let's just go like leave the south gate, 
walk a, a small pace outside and look back at the walls, <laughs> knowing that we've, you know, lifted the curse of time off of this place, and then we can decide, all right, where the Technically, fuck Technically, I lifted it because I walked out. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, after walking a short ways south and looking back at Vignon, the curse is lifted uh, from the town, yes? Yes. We did it! And immediately after leaving the town, you can start to see, well, you immediately see that everything in the town ages nine years of zero upkeep. Oh. So. Yeah, that tower crumbled over there. Mm-hmm. That house. <laughs> <laughs> that was regrettable. But it such was are the inevitable. such are the ways of time. Yes. What now? We have two of these artifacts. Cadorna's in a cult with this sorcerer king, but they no longer have any of these orbs. I imagine Since they're going have... to come hunting us. Didn't we have another lead that was going to lead us into uh, yes. Nordland? Sankt Michaelsburg. <clears throat> Apparently the uh, headquarters of the cult of the Sorcerer King. But, uh, if uh, you remember, Rhiannon, I believe Darun and Carrie have business to attend to in Lugtau. Though, if I remember correctly, said that is on the other side of Norland. Nor? Oh my god, dude. Oh yeah, it's all <laughs> coming together. Oh yeah, it's all coming together. Uh, what, the, the bulls? I imagine the Sorcerer King and Luigi are in St. Michaelsburg. And if, uh, Darun and uh, Carrie, if you two need to get to Lugtau, and it seems that for now, we are heading the same direction. Why are we inviting the cultists to join us? <laughs> we didn't. We told him to go do something for us. To clear his name. and to. He's gonna go do the thing. He's gonna cleanse the temple. We did a good. With holy flame. Yeah, yeah, that, that was the joke I was making. He's gonna get I... anyone capable of cleansing it, like. But what happened to him? He was also under the spell of nine years. What happened to him? Well, he aged nine years. Yeah. You all never. You. He didn't follow you out of the town, so. You have no, no idea. Yeah. Well, he probably just aged so five, what, nine years. What, so and here's then, a question: Were we going to use the orb of teleportation <laughs> to get to I, their ship? <laughs> well, <laughs> I'm, well, I'm we just did, wondering. I have no reason to get on that ship. Yeah, what reason do we have to go back with them? No, you, they ditched the party yeah, to go on their own side adventure. No, well, Virgil, you Vir, Virgil is intent on going to Saint Michaelsburg. We're still, we're still willing to help. We just went our own way for now, but if you want to join us during the journey, we'll be, we'd love to. Yeah, Out of game, of course. Yeah, but we're doing the main quest line right now, so like... Oh, well, no. we also have to attend with, real quick, here's another factor. It is in the interest of Carrie, uh, Trisferian, and Darun to get on that ship, because that is their quickest way to Lubtau. I'm pretty sure the crystal is our quickest way to move town. Actually, yeah. yeah, no, the orb is the quickest way to move town. <laughs> but that, that, I get, that, that, okay, that depends on, uh, does Trisferian want to use that orb to, uh... No! No, no, no. What does he want to use it for? Because... Go to Brindle. Yeah. Because <laughs> we're on a ship, and here's the thing. Once we deal with Lutau, we don't have a time constraint anymore. We have two of the artifacts they absolutely must have. And they'll come hunting for us. 
I but mean, if we use a teleportation spell, who the fuck's gonna actually know where we went? I, and on the plus side... I mean, that's a real question. Yeah, I know you're opposed to it, but it also means they can't technically take the teleportation orb away from us without killing Tristarian. Yeah, it, it's well, just that... I, I understand... That's not really like, like, yeah, no, yeah. I understand what you're talking about. It's just that... Well, uh, Louis, No, no. Like, what, the, what this means is... Technically, if Trisferian uses the orb, and the orb is effectively bound to him till he dies, mm -hmm. the party gets to gar make sure Trisferian doesn't die. Ever. Mm. Which they're very good at. Not well, really. I mean, yeah. No, no, they're great at making me not get hit. They're great at not... They, they walk and get hit first <laughs> anyway. I understand like... that, yeah, no, Trisferian wants to go to Prindle. Mm. It's just I don't, that... I, I'm going to be real with you. I don't think I took a single point of damage that entire dungeon, Virgil, aside from the first part. Virgil does feel compelled to go to St. Michaelsburg to confront... Uh, Kadorna. Kadorna. The beach. Yeah. But he, see, he, this he way, can be, you he can be, he can be convinced otherwise, but that needs to be done in character. Please do. Pause. So Please yeah, do. no. I need an accountant. So where I where I last remember where we were in, in character, uh, Ke uh, Carrie, or now Eleanor, <laughs> asked uh, Trisferian if he plans to use the orb. I said if the need arises. Oh, that's right. I, it? If I were to wait, uh, if I remember correctly, this cult of the Sorcerer King is based in a uh, Norian city, Saint Michaelsburg, near the, bo near the border with Soissons. That's where I'm headed. That's where. That's where Cadorna is. I know it. I, uh, it might be too much to ask, but if you do plan on using the orb, could you take me there? Uh, potentially. Uh, what I, do you I, plan? I feel, I feel we, we shouldn't use the orb uh, willy-nilly. Well, then what do you think we should do? I was thinking of a dwarf. Rindo. That was his name? Okay. Uh, yeah, okay, yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I imagine he'd be offended. If they didn't that. tell you his name, how would you possibly get there? <laughs> I was more making a joke of uh, I know. how best that I was. <laughs> I know. What about Rindo? Yeah. Uh, well, what if I told you we could regain his, uh, presence? You plan... you, uh, How do we get to him? You see, I mm. pick up a globular device. So the orb. <laughs> you, you, so you do. <laughs> so let's not... So let's not... Use, so Pop. if I understand, let's not use the orb <laughs> too quickly, but let's use it to get to Brindle. I see. And what do you think? Uh, you, you think you'd come back into the fold just like that? I, we can tell him that all of us, including him, are be going to be chased by horrible cultists. Uh, unless he helps us. And I suppose we should tell him that he shot Luigi. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he the shot your friend who was secretly the bad guy the entire yeah, fucking time. The, the <laughs> Wait, do you one, even though. know he shot Luigi? Yes, we can. Yes. We can so, infer. Uh, we, we asked Luigi how, it, like, if he was shot and if it was him, and he said yes. If I remember correctly, he's on a ship with Long Watcher. Yes. Uh, that would probably be correct. I wouldn't know since I'm not on a boat with a hairy anchor. Are those, two, are those two are managing to run a ship? I have no idea. I don't think they you aren't. run a ship. I think you sail a ship. 
They command said ship. <laughs> no. That's Wait all they do. They command Wait said ship. I wouldn't put it past them to have developed a way for the ship to, in fact, begin to run. What are they, gnomes? No, no, no. They they just picked up the ship. <laughs> Them and a bunch of people picked up like a small fishing boat and started running with their ship. Well, Flintstone, the bitch. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> it became a land ship. See, if Steve were here, we could literally get the first bit of that out of the way. But, <laughs> but it is going on at 10 o'clock. No. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Maverick said he was his time. What about the. Uh... Well, I just don't. I can't like just do more than like. What about? Hours. I had like a nine-hour session. On what that. about the runes matter in Lubtal? What was his manner in Lubtal again? <laughs> like his family estate. Something yes, about the uh, yeah. I... His family I estate. I mean, how far of a walk is Lubtal? Lubtal is on the other side of no of the Empire. But that is a legitimate question, like how far of a like journey with yeah, like, walk the empire like, versus sailing yeah. along the coast of Barak Doom and from Barak Doom down to Drest. Would you like to look at that map? At this point, I'm asking that character. Yeah, I can't tab out because of this one. Because we need to know if that's even what's more feasible. What's you know? I will be right back. I'm going to go to the bathroom. Okay. All right. Virgil Bye. takes out his uh, map that he has in his uh, you know, pack, and he opens it, showing it to Tristan. Is there anyone else to use? Yes, look here. We are here, on the left. In, uh, you see there, Vignon. Right here. Luptau is here, and the Empire is this broad swath in the middle. It's, uh, it's quite the journey. He then closes it. So we're outside of town, right? Yeah, we are standing outside of town. I had to mute real quick, sorry. This game has a very loud volume. Mm. Very loud. Okay, I'm good. I'm back. Welcome back. Video. Can I switch this to full borderless, full borderless window? Thank you. Oh, dude, this is way better. So we, uh, so if I understand, we use the orb that takes us to Brindel, who we will use to sail to Lubtau. All the while, we'll be hunted by Kadorna and the cult of the Sorcerer King. What do yep, you, uh... sounds about right. It seems like uh, we've managed to uh, get ourselves into quite the predicament. Yes, I wonder who the cause of it is. Uh, technically, go it's gonna be many me. Fingers. Technically, who? Uh, don't worry, Brindle. Nope. No, all right, we're all just looking at certain someone who's friends with an evil right. person. I, I, I look. Uh, Virgil looks at uh, <laughs> at uh, keep Audrey changing now. People. He's like, <laughs> he's like. <laughs> it's an amazing power, you know? <laughs> okay, that was that was that was good. I'll give you that one. That was good. Damn, <laughs> that was old. good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Please tell me that was in character. No, you have to make that in character. That was in character. <laughs> It is officially in character now. <laughs> oh. 
no way that can't be in character. <laughs> you know, all oh, yeah. Darun is surprised by nothing and only manages to own people. <laughs> <laughs> It's more like he's probably just gotten so cynical, he's like, well, fuck it. <laughs> the entire world can go fuck itself. See, I what might not always get one, but every thousand years or so I get a good one. <laughs> okay, I'm back. Welcome back. Welcome back. So, uh, quick timeline <laughs> question. Please. Uh, the timeline question is that us ending tonight at going to uh, where uh, you guys are would be a really good way to end it. Yep. We can just say Steve's character's asleep. It's the middle of the night. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, no, no. We, we plane shift. And that's it. Jeez. Yeah. We'll end with the plane shift. Exactly. Right. And then next, we'll be. Uh, I'll be like, by my ancestors' nether hairs. What are you doing here? No, we oh, all. I, I thought when you said by heads. my ancestors' nether hairs. I now we all disappear in a broom closet. Like, Virgil also. It's like, are we there? No, no. We're obviously uh, somewhere dark and with uh, the smell of salt, and we're rocking back and forth. No, we're we're obviously. In the middle of an earthquake. Really? No! <laughs> I still don't know how the hell I'm gonna fix the time sync problem, yeah. but. I uh... have an idea. I know how. Mm. I know how to resolve it. Because we are using the planar shift orb while, while also we're carrying having the, the time, time orb. No, 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 no. We go we're not the orb. Re We're not gonna. Okay. First of all, we're not going to re-desecrate the land, but I'm also not going to fucking make myself... No, 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 uh, no, 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 It doesn't desecrate. It's because we have it on in our inventory. What the fuck is this? The Infinity Stones? It no. Fuck, no, it fucks with time. It's no. Best, Basically, it's when you have way two to while you're using this. one, it, it forces you to go through the warp rather than okay, just... Okay, what the port? Best way no, 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 no. Circle. What port were these fuckers at? supposed to be at, we at don't the end know. of the seven days. No, or are oh, they in seven days? days? Yeah, at the end of the, at the, at the, if we went to the other side of the coin, all right, where <laughs> would they be? What port? We're going to the fucking boat. What do you mean? Because they, you guys have to join no, no, the ship. Guys, the I just need to know the one the the answer to the question. What I port really were these guys... Yeah, that's the question. Jeff, the bring back what? the map. Ah, what do you? No, ask your question again. I still didn't understand what the fuck what, you meant. Uh, do you remember what port they went to at the end of their uh, campaign? Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, I do. I do. Yeah. All right. What was How it far is that port I'll from bring us? It up. I'll bring it up. Okay. okay, okay, okay I got to murder okay, a okay, cat. Because okay, yeah, 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 I forget where it was. I'll bring it up. I'll bring it up. Okay. All right. Here's what's up. Here's what we're working with, all right? So they ended, the last port they went to was Corsaville. 